Uh, just looking at the ESC to see that it is the new one. You can see where it says drag brake right on it. Looking by, everything looks like it's still stock. It's snowing, it's perfect, okay, and we'll cut right back. Hey everybody, what's up? It's Medic at the RC Spark Studio. Here to do something a little bit different. Who's ready for a RC narrative director's cut? So here we are, about to do our first spring run of 2011. It's snowing outside a little bit. We got the axials and the CR1 ready to go. Let's do it! <laughs> so these are some of the uh, scenes from one of our films back in early spring 2011. Yes, it's in Calgary, Canada. Uh, it is a snowy winter wonderland in about April. Got the boys coming out uh, from Rude Boys RC. Crazy Joe riding in this uh, axial here. That's a Proline Jeep Comanche body. Uh, Proline.com, you guys can probably find it. Uh, really fits well on an axial dingo. My buddy Paul. <laughs> Everybody's bringing out their trucks here. Paul's there. There we go. That's actually a Hilux body on an axial frame. <laughs> you guys, this is on my new channel, RC Narrate. Uh, you guys, uh, I'm not going to... I'm not going to be editing out the swear words or stuff, so parents be warned, please, if you're watching this video. That is a skill driving. This is uncut, uh, raw footage. You know, some of the scenes I thought you would all like to see. Behind the scenes, the snow is really deep. You'll see. Push me out, Jay. You'll see in this video how deep it is. That's my buddy Jay up there trying to push out uh -oh. my blue Jeep axial. Uh -oh. <laughs> God, crazy Joe, also in trouble in the deep snow. Okay. <laughs> I can't go back up. At points of this film, I'm gonna just be quiet and let you watch. The 1.9. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Biggest letdown ever. 1.9s in deep snow. Ain't gonna happen. <laughs> on my Jeep, I've got uh, RC four wheel drive mudslingers. Yeah, that's what those are on that one. Rolling over Oh! Nice, Joe. Bingo, bango, bongo. Sacrifice yourself for the cause there, Joe. All the way down the hill. See my buddy Jay, he's got uh, HPI rock grabbers on that CR01 Tamiya. Everyone mostly running 2.2s in deep snow like this. 1.9s like the dingo. Just sink up to the axles. Paul rocking it without a bumper. Gonna hook up a tow rope camera on on my dingo here to get the dingo cam in the real films this is an unedited version of two films I put out that have been seen almost a hundred thousand times each crazy Joe also running uh, mudslingers on his truck yeah Planning out these shots can be a challenge, of course, because I'm filming all of them, trying to get them to work for our film. Here's a nice shot of Paul's truck with the motorcycle in the back. A little bit weird scale, but uh, totally awesome for film. Not sure what kind of tires those are. Uh, they look like TSLs, I think. HPI rock grabbers on the CR01 again. You ready? Folks ask me where I get my vehicles. A variety of stores online, of course. PMHobby.com is my Canadian store that I go to. <clears throat> this was a wonderful scene of all trail riding. Except I got the orange uh, barriers in the background, so that was a bit of a bummer. Uh, becomes unusable footage for me. Unless you can expand the film to, you know, minus out the non-scale things. 
You got it. Go ahead. Action. And from this scene, all of us in a line uh, was one of the very popular ones in the original movie. Uh, of course, everybody on a, a group trail gathering like this playing follow the leader. Deep snow poses a challenge. Not only does the snow pose the challenge for the tires, but it also poses the challenge for um, the actual shocks and the shock oil. Also, the rubber compound changes in the cold. They become much stiffer. The shock oil becomes thicker and your suspension becomes very rigid. What a beautiful shot of the uh, Proline 2009 Jeep Wrangler body that I had. Those are integer shocks. I've had those shocks forever. I have multiple sets of them. Those aren't Rockstar rims, uh, but there's something like that from RC Four Wheel Drive. The winch is a three racing winch. I also got it at PM Hobby. <laughs> Everyone's trying to be quiet so we can get film without voices in it. Very appreciated, guys. I know how hard it is to get a group of folks together to do a video like nice. this and to have them, you know, be cool. <laughs> All this awesome action going on while I'm chatting. <laughs> have them be cool and not say a whole lot while I'm filming is both tough and an honor because we're all having fun out there, hey? <laughs> you can hear it. <laughs> Old Yoda. Yo, Medic, we're going in some water today, though, You bet you can. Yo, Medic, we're going in some water today, okay? <laughs> you know it. You film us? Mud, whatever. Yeah, we can find some. Look, I'm already, my heart's pumping right now. <laughs> Crazy Joe and Paul <laughs> chatting it up. You guys are right. I haven't, I had started filming. You can go on to the dirt. You can you guys, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> I gotcha. set okay. up for the shot. Okay, three. Yeah, you got to shut up for the shot because I can't edit all the <laughs> Get the fuck out of the way, Paul. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're good. We're just going to drive. We're going to drive around that bend where I stop. It's like herding cats. Those guys are all awesome. Love every one of those dudes. They all made a huge effort that day to come out and uh, put on a good show for you guys in the freezing cold. Epic, thank you. I stopped. <laughs> That's how deep the snow was. <laughs> Up to your knees. People are telling me that I should switch tires. <coughs> Excuse me. Or I should... Uh, make my truck a little bit uh, softer in suspension. Holy cow, you guys. Come on out here for a few winters. Come scaling. We'll tell you how to set up your truck. <laughs> yep, Canada. You shall not pass. <laughs> This was a great shot. I love nice, tight, close-up shots. The dingo cam was actually rolling at this point, uh, watching all the dudes go by. It was great. The reason the dingo's sitting there is because the one nines wouldn't make it through all the snow. <laughs> That's the other thing. People say, why aren't you guys running one nines? It would look so much more scale with the one nines on there. Because you guys have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> It may look more scale, but you ain't going anywhere. Hey, Dingo, kind of making it along with us. <laughs> the Jeep was following the Dingo so they could push him. <laughs> yes, this shot. Multiple times I took this shot. I didn't, I screwed up here. Ah, well, that was somebody else driving my rig. But I should have been smoother. Oh, nice save. Yeah, a new driver that day. wasn't quite sure of how to use my... Uh, I think it was a lefty driving that day, my right-handed controller. She did good, though. It's a girl that's doing it. I can't remember. I think it's Rick's wife. Yeah, that was a lighter. Just lighting a candle. For all those who care. <laughs> 
nice. You can see how I'm filming in transitions. Like I'm planning my shots as we go down the trail. So I'm setting myself in different areas to capture these very unique shots. So when I edit, all I have to do is kind of cut and paste, cut and paste. Very cool. me any order that's what she said <laughs> sorry <laughs> HPI rock grabbers great in the snow TSL boggers not so much if those are TSLs I think they are good job Paul that was good driving buddy you made it all the way up there first shot I took each crawler in succession, uh, knowing that I could have clipped these shots together in one film. <clears throat> so that's why you see a bit of repetitiveness. Try to get the best shots. Film as much as you can, but planned, and then you can use them later for editing. Great shot. That was when Joe's uh, Comanche body was brand new. And the dingo. Sad truth right here. 1.9 flat irons uncut. Brand new out of the box dingo. Beauty. Oh, oh. So close. So close. And I'm filming, and I'm wanting him to go. Rick's wondering if he's doing a good job of driving in this shot. He is. Epic, actually. He just kept going. That's what you want your subjects to do when you're filming them. Keep filming them. Because the struggle and the win is what makes your RC video look amazing. Come on, brother! Come on! And then I decide to assist it. Give him a bit of a push. Oh, my finger came in that shot. Look at that. That's fucked. Yeah. I could tell I saw it. So what I did in the video was I just cut it in the middle. Uh, and, and people always wondered at the end of that video, was it the dingo? Did it actually make it? It just kind of stopped like the end of the Sopranos did. Black screen. This is just extra footage. Getting windy out there. The dingo cam was rolling the whole time. Look at this untouched snow. This is right before the big melt, of course. Then the river floods and all this is underwater. <coughs> Deep. Yeah, you can tell I'm screwed. I don't need... <laughs> Joe from Rude Boys, you having a good time scaling today? Yeah! Woo! There's Fucking my buddy. Winter spring crawling. <laughs> <laughs> That's dedication. Those are true RC addicts right there. Look at old AM radio. Jason Larvey, buddy. <laughs> this was a scene we used in the second film. Awesome teamwork. People can laugh that we're playing with toys, but I don't give a shit. You guys, this is a great time. And doesn't cost as much as 4x4. Four four oh, with the real thing.
This is when I introduced the dingo cam in the last film. We did an onboard shot of us pushing this truck. I'll put links at the end of this video. Ramstein's one of the uh, forum members down at uh, rcsparks.com. My buddy Rick. And uh, he's running my new dingo for me today. Uh, I gotta ask, uh, how's that drag bag break? Can you tell any difference? I can see the biggest difference in the world with that drag brake. I have no slippage in the snow. And if I start losing it, I just tap back and she stops nicely for me. Nice. Axial commercial as well. Yeah, pretty much. What well, Axial doesn't pay me to do any of this stuff, you guys, by the way. It's not a sponsored link by Axial. They don't do shit for me, actually. They send me product to market for them, but happen. this here, that like, does happen. it's all us, man. There we go. Great teamwork. Those mud boggers, mud slingers just burning right into the snow. He's just messing around here. What happened? What happened? <laughs> lady down, lady down. So <laughs> nice job. That's okay. Nice job. <laughs> here we go, here we go. Onto the creek, Fish Creek Joe. Ooh, 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 uh, thank you, almost fell. <laughs> so they all wanted to go to the water. This was their opportunity to transition from their snow up there to the water that was frozen and had open holes. <laughs> I warned them. It was still awesome though. <laughs> People ask me how fast the crawlers go. That's about that fast. <laughs> they crawl. They're not meant for speed. Yeah, you're going to come along this ridge and then down. Planning the shots. As a producer, you can see the movie. <laughs> you guys having a good time? Woo! <laughs> yeah, all right. Man, I was so lucky to have them there. They're all so supportive. Because trying to direct people when they're out having fun is a bit of a challenge, right? I wanted them to go along the ridge, which is exactly what they did for me. That's five stars, dudes. Look at that. Here's this great shot of them going along the ridge. I think his motorbike just fell out of the back of the truck. <laughs> Still, look at that. Right by me, I'm actually laying on the ice of the shallow creek just to get this one continuous shot. The dingo cam is still rolling. It's a Tachyon XC uh, HD cam, by the way. It's not a GoPro. It's a forward-facing hunting uh, type of camera. Here's an opposite shot of what they just did. This is the hill they just went down towards me. Now I've changed my position to go to the other side. Multiple shots, guys, makes a, makes a long uh, RC adventure for me. Not just long, but gives you guys multiple shots. Nice assistance. Assist again. Look at that. Nice little push. One nines. 1.9 scale tires. Push, push, push. There you go, there you go. And then the two twos. And the HPIs, look at that, not a problem. Just having fun, booting around. Now we know we filmed a lot. <laughs> Get wrench! We know we've got a lot of footage now, now we're just screwing around. Oh, I think your camera just yeah. bash. Will you bash? I'm hitting her full throttle. Okay, I'll full throttle too then, okay? Nice. Waiting for action. Action! <laughs> Joe lost into the netherland. <laughs> oh. They don't care. They're all waterproof anyway. Nice. Guys, if you want to see how to waterproof trucks like this, just go and YouTube search how to waterproof an RC. That's it. You'll find lots of us have done videos like that. I did on my oh. DJ Medic 2008 channel. Okay. <clears throat> nice. Should have used that scene. Oh, I didn't use it because of the legs in the background of Rick there. 
Um, I try in RC Ventures to keep humans out of it. Resetting the shot. It's a great transition shot, guys. From one scene to another, I could have used that. If there was more trucks, I could have used it as a transition. I try to keep a certain sense of continuity to my uh, films. Beautiful. That's a great shot. Don't forget the <laughs> yes, yeah, for sure, buddy. Anything for the RC. <laughs> Jason working on his CRO one. There's Crazy Joe. <laughs> He's trying to run it under the whole ice. He's like, I can get it under there. There's no way because of the rocks. No, 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 it'll get stuck. Not worth the risk. Crazy Joe, Rude Boys RC. Hey, I'm gonna come across. It's because we have so many of these little bastards. We do everything we can. It's wet. Ready? Yeah. Nice. Oh, that's we do everything we can to entertain you guys with RC Adventures. Crazy Joe has gone out of his way to. Uh, same with Ted from Ted's Garage. I'll anytime. Yeah. All right, so there we got another RC Adventure for you guys. Our first trailing of spring 2011, and we had a wicked ass time. So Woo! See you guys next time. <laughs> All right. That was a good end scene. These are extra coast. bonus scenes. Motor, 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 That's motor, mine. Anyway. Yeah, on a three cell, 35 turn, can't handle the power. Oh, and maybe the dunk in the water. <laughs> <laughs> all the, they were, I was trying to get them all together for a picture so we could have a good go thumbnail. <laughs> like, I'm going to have to walk over there and do this. He's like, no, no, let me just drive into spot. I'm like, ah, brother. But he drives a Jeep like that in real life. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, perfect. Perfect. Yeah, oh. there's a few shots here for sure. Kind of sounds like I know myself. Now we're trying to drive out of this place. This is where one of the great famous scenes came from, the thumbnail, where they were towing each other. And it wasn't because they needed to either. It was just because they wanted to see if they could buddy up a huge hill. Yeah, once you're committed, you can't stop on deep snow like that or you sink. Oh, 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 don't wrap, Paul. There you go. That worked out well. Here's the scene. You guys recognize this for all the viewers of RC Adventures. Look how deep that is. So they're trying to assist. <laughs> Good job, guys. That's the buddy system at its best right there. That's what it's all about at rcsparks.com, guys. This is what it's about right here. You can join the forums for free. You can support the forums and be a supporting member. You don't have to by any means. Uh, it's just there if you want to do it. Have fun. Talk to these guys. Oh, that was not a jump. <laughs> so I'm going to put up a couple of links here for you. Uh, if you want to see the real films, there's actually two of them. Uh, my pleasure. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, check these out. Come on down to rcsparks.com if you want. Also, I'm on Facebook. Uh, my personal account is facebook.com forward slash rcadventures. Pretty simple. Uh, if you guys like what you see here on RC Narrate, this is my new channel, so make sure to subscribe, please, uh, as this just goes hand in hand with my DJ Medic 2008 channel. Until next time, you guys, go out there and have some fun, and I'll see you on the trails.